Good morning, boys and girls. This is Pastor Nancy, and I'm going to tell you about so many things today. I'm filming for Sunday, December 20th, and we're still in Advent. It's the fourth Sunday of Advent, and I have a calendar, a candle, fourth Sunday of Advent, and we're talking about love. But you do notice I have Advent blue on, but behind me we're decorating for Christmas because I want us to get really excited for Christmas Eve too. So you'll see behind me are some really beautiful candles not yet lit. And Lois is with us and she wants to say something right away. Pastor Nancy, I am so excited. Lois is excited. Why are you excited? Wow, there is a girl named Lily, who has lit the Advent wreath. Lily has lit the Advent wreath. Oh, I'm excited too. So we are going to go to Lily's house right now and watch Lily light four candles for Advent. Let's watch. Today is the fourth Sunday in Advent. Today we will light four candles. Wow, thank you, Lily. Thank you so much. And as we're saying, Lord, make my heart ready to receive your glorious love. Amen. The fourth Sunday in Advent, we're talking about love. Love, wow, love. Yes. And I'm going to say something. It's a little bit grown up, but it's part of thinking about love. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word became flesh to dwell among us. Full of grace and truth. That's a lot, isn't it? The Word became flesh. Flesh. Mm, flesh. Flesh is like this. Flesh. Flesh. God, in all God's bigness, wanted to really relate to us. So this Christmas story that we're preparing for is about how God loves us and God is thinking, how can I relate to people? And I will come to earth. I know, I know, Jesus comes to earth in the form of a baby. Yes. So it's so worth Advent to wait and be expectant and be hopeful. And now I'm going to show you the bulletin cover. I'm going to bring this right up to the camera. It says, Christmas is love. Christmas is love. Let's, let's go all the way so people can really see that. Christmas is love. Oh, Christmas. Oh. So this season that we've been waiting for, lighting candles, the first and then the second, then the third, then the fourth, the Advent wreath is exciting and preparing for the birth of Christ, God's way of loving us. <gasps> How else do you show that you love someone? Love! Hmm. How do we show we love each other, especially this time of year? I know, I know, I know, I know. Oh, what do you want to say? It's a word I learned a couple weeks ago. We show love by our attitude. Lois, you're so right. A loving attitude, oh, is opposite of an unloving attitude. Unloving attitude, hmm. And we all have both. We all have both, but we pray, God, help me choose love. Help me choose love instead of unlove. Love is patient and kind, not envious, jealous, or rude. That's it right there. Love. During this special time, God loves us. We love because God first loved us. So this is the week before Christmas. I know. Let's practice attitude of love. Oh my goodness. And, we, and love is patient and kind, not jealous, envious, or rude. Rude. Oh my goodness. We, we all have a tendency to get rude sometimes when we're tired. So pray, God, help me 
expect the birth of your baby Jesus with loving hearts and, and help prepare him room in my heart. Oh, so I want to end with excitement. I'm so excited and, and um, we get to show you a preview. So please have your family have Christmas Eve. It will we'll have background from Messiah here and we'll have also some filming from First Lutheran. Isn't that fun? And we'll have a children's sermon that includes live animals, sheep and calves. Yes, sheep and calves. And now I want to end with you getting a little snippet of um, Joseph leading a mule or a donkey. And Mary is, is on top of the donkey. I get the confused, if, but Mary and Joseph are going to Bethlehem. And this is a little preview of our children's sermon we really want you to see next week. And at the end of our children's sermon, there'll be a, um, an original song about sheep by John Hope. Wow, this is so much. So God bless you. May God give you patience and love this week. Okay, everybody, watch the video now. Goodbye. Goodbye.